well, first of all I would like to say that before installing every one of this pig and hive first make sure you have a Hadoop installed on your computer and at first we will write down the CD statement just like what I'm doing to change the directory to the home then all you have to do is just copy paste all of these commands which I'm showing one by one uh, watch it carefully and um, I'll be putting all of this command in the description below so as you can see the our pick 0.17 tar file is been downloaded after the downloadation is finished we will use this tar xdf command to extract it okay extraction has been done now we'll create a soft link for the pick folder is naming it pig only now i'll verify with ls ldr command whether the soft link has been created or not as you can see the soft link has been created here it's nothing just like a shortcut in your windows computer now i will open the bash rc file using gedit So after opening the file, all you have to do, all you have to do is scroll below and see whether the pig has been dated or not. Okay. Just getting down, I am writing and comment on a link pick and I will probably add this this two of these um, information this to configuration on this configuration file and export it now I will save it close this and now I'll use this command source bash.rc. Okay. Now I'll start my Hadoop cluster. Start all search. Okay, it's already been uh, started, so it's saying to stop it. Uh, it doesn't matter. Let me check whether they are being started or not. Yes, they have been started. Now I will run this command Mr. Joe Street to run the history server. Now let's see with JPS command whether the history server has been started or not. Yes, job history server has been started. And now I'll just type pick and enter. Okay, so here's we come across a problem. It's saying that Java Home is not yet set. Uh, so I think I have also have to add uh, this two into the source ST file as rc file. Java and going to export this. Now run the source case file. Okay. Now let's try starting pig. Okay, so, so pig is successfully started. Now we can use pig to type our commands, and that's it. Thanks for everything. If you have any questions or something like that, you can comment it down below. So I will help it.